A woman and her little boy are survivors of a violent standoff in Lawrence, although she is badly injured. The man who police say held them hostage ultimately turned his gun on himself, but not before shooting at police and forcing schools into lockdown. Our Julie Lonchek is live in Lawrence tonight. And Julie, after so many hours, police just reopened that street. They did, and we were able, Lisa, to speak with this victim's close friend who tells us the victim just yesterday filed a restraining order against the suspect. Tonight, she is in critical condition at Mass General. Late into the night, investigators could be seen processing the scene on Melrose. Take cover, take cover, got shots fired. Where hours earlier, they were under attack. Everybody take cover, take cover, he's firing at us. Police responded to a domestic dispute in Lawrence just after noon, but almost immediately had to retreat when the male suspect opened fire. The officers were shot at a, a few times, at least twice. Uh, they returned fire. One officer returned fire, covering uh, big protection for the other officers on scene. Multiple agencies descended to secure the scene and to try to save the life of the 36-year-old woman shot twice in her apartment, police say, by her live-in boyfriend. Her four-year-old son was also inside and rescued. We took great, uh, great measures to make sure that the child uh, was taken out safely. The woman's family and friends understandably distraught. She was to the police station to get a restraining order on him. And then she came back home thinking that he's leaving because he got all of his clothes ready to leave. Then when she came back here, he was inside the house and everything happened. You guys are in the line of fire here. As was an entire neighborhood forced to evacuate and parents informed the schools their children attend were locked down. It's pretty scary that can something like that, you know, that there's... Something that can happen so close to home. Police say they had never been called to this third floor apartment. The mayor says we as a society can do better. Domestic violence is something that's a societal problem for us. We got to figure this thing out. Um, this is something that every community has to deal with. Physically, that four year old is going to be okay tonight. He and his 10 year old brother, who was not home at the time, are in the custody of DCF. Police say the suspect committed suicide. We're live in Lawrence, Julie Lonchak, WBZ News. David, back to you. Julie, thank you.